Hello everybody and welcome back. My name is Mate and today we are continuing the Lannister playthrough. So if you missed the last episode, uh, Stefan has died and we're now playing as Joffrey. Not uh, the Joffrey we know from the series, not this Joffrey. But in fact, Joffrey, who would in fact be Joffrey's grandson, I believe. So we're going to marry Daenerys's daughter, uh, primarily because she's quick, and she's got very good traits for the age of 10, and we're not the best. Jolzmin, you'll be our new master at arms, and you will be my new spy master. Now, uh, in terms of attributes, we're going to try to improve diplomacy, because as you can see, that is terrible. She has accepted, so that's good. Anyone plotting? Yep, I've got a couple of plots. Okay. Now, we also have the problem of the Riverlands. And what to do with them. See, my wondering is, if I give it to Victor Lannister, will I receive it as his heir? I would hope I would. But I cannot guarantee that. Um, so, I'm going to go for it anyway. I'm also going to give Joffrey a haircut. Something a bit more civilised. A bit more ornate, maybe. That's quite ornate. Let's go for that for now. Right, so let's uh, declare war on Clay. He has... 11,000 troops at his disposal. Hmm. I may need to hold a feast before I do this war then. Because we have nothing. And we have no allies either. Victor, you're a good fighter. I'll give you to... Josmin. We still don't have Castamir. Which is very annoying. However, not much I can do about that for the minute. So, we're going to pay for uh, some good entertainment for everyone. We'll also send out the Marshal. Castle Rock is coming along nicely. 8,000 garrison, 6,000 troops. So that's going well. Uh, we will spend lavishly, of course. We've also gained uh, Castlewood, or Sir Tobbot of Fang Tower has. Which is good. Let's invite everyone to the party. How does Ashmark not like me? More to the point, why doesn't Ashmark like me? That's very confusing. We are trying to better relations with them, so... We'll see how that goes. Any war going on? Yes, Daenerys is facing a war from the north. I need to find... Yeah, Raylar. Why isn't she at my court? No, she won't. Bugger. Okay. Uh, Victor, I knew him well. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, entertaining feast. Good, good. Close friends with Silverhall. Nice. We need a new Meister. So my Meister's just died. And the High Septon has just died as well. How are we doing troop-wise? 19,000. Baron has appeared. Good. Baron, are you any good? You're okay, you're not the best. Everyone has had a good time. 
Troops, 23,000, not bad. We've improved diplomacy. Wow. I thought we were at two. We can't have improved it by seven, surely. Maybe we have. Sweet. Um, in which case, we will go for... That's a, another good one to have. Improved martial ability might be nice. Yeah, let's do that. Um, and let's declare war on him now. Whilst he's still at the same rate and we're at a much higher. So we're going to go for... Victor Lannister's claim. And I'm going to send everyone to this particular spot. Why are you going... What on earth? Why are you going around that way? Go this way, please. There we go. So we'll build this army up, we'll try and take River Run. he's got no allies apart from the Freys. He's also fighting, interestingly enough. Turnbridge. So, the crossing is led by a Frey from the Turnbridge, interesting. Lucia Lannister, she has good diplomacy, let's give her to the best diplomat, which is Elseth. Uh people are annoyed, that's fine. Good. Better relations with Ashmark. Perfect. So Paris and I had a good time. Sweet. Uh, let's improve relations now with... Actually, let's check. Tarbit Hall. Might be a good one. How many troops can they give me? Not that many, actually. Who's low? Hornvale. Let's go to Hornvale, then. Who's the High Lord of Hornvale? She is, so we'll improve relations with her. And how are we doing down here? Not too bad. Let's take him off that. Make sure he can lead the troops in battle. May his reign be blessed. Hmm. I'm going to keep these two separate. Just so we can get a, uh, a bonus in terms of uh, having a reinforcement come in. New Lord Commander, Bowen Marsh has died. So the Net White Swatch is now Matthew Cloacy. Interesting. Quite a good marshal. Better than me anyway. But then he would be. Let's pray for courage. Give us a marshal. So that gives us that ambition. Ambitions we're going through quite well. I can improve diplomacy again. Let's do that. So we actually went from 2 to 7. So the 9 must have been because of the feast, which is fair enough. So let's start heading towards the River Run. Which I assume is where he is at. Yeah. So we should have double his forces. Hopefully. And a 5,000... Ooh, okay. Let's just hold here. And go to Branston. And let's go straight in there. So we'll reinforce with these guys, hopefully, as quickly as possible. Well done, Septon. So that reinforcement boost should... Should help us a great deal. Doesn't look to be... In terms of morale, but they seem to be breaking. Yeah, they should be gone by now. So that's a good victory. Pleased with that. 
I will have the 7,000 army go to follow and we'll carry on sieging with the 8,000 stack. So Lord Blackwood is taking a lot of people prisoner. Right, let's carry on following them up. There we go, one more. I think we should do it. Maybe two. If there's enough troops left. 83 87 91 <laughs> oh, So he's obviously hired some uh, mercenaries Because of the uh who's this? I know not. Whoa 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 whoa. What's going on? People are being arrested all over the place. And I am not knowing why. And I've also got quite a bit of money. Anything we can build, not yet. Once the states we'll build that when we have enough. So Wyman was captured. Sweet, we can ransom him off. Uh, let's just besiege Stonehenge. He may well come to me saying, actually, uh, we realise we've lost this battle. So sorry. But then again, he may not. Let's build these modest estates. See if we can uh, assault this. We can't assault this because I'm not the leader of the siege. Alright, well, let's assault this place then. When we get the chance. Well, actually, we've nearly got River Run, so. I'd rather not waste the 5,000. Let's just keep it going, see if we can get there before it. Large estate. So that gives us another 400 light infantry. Which actually gives us another 0 0.20 tax income, which is good. So we're making quite a bit of money despite having all these forces up. Perhaps it hasn't quite taken into account that's occurring. I don't know. Excellent news, well done, Ashmark. Good lad. There we go. River Run has been besieged, so that is all done and dusted. So Clay Stark is now at Tunbridge Keep. I still need to try and have him killed. Potentially. So who's your heir? Your heir is... Arya. Oh, yeah. And then Tully's. So we still have the same problem. I can't claim the Riverlands. So now that we know that, we have an ally in a Lannister. So now we know that, I think our next objective will be the North. Kane Reed. He's got 9,000 troops. Uh, does he have any allies? He's got a few allies, but no one of any importance. When the time comes and we've rebuilt our forces, perhaps, you know, pretty quickly, the next episode, I will claim the north for the Restolans. I'll also finally get recompense for John Umber stealing Castamere from me. And, uh... We should be the most powerful paramountcy then with the north and the westerlands and perhaps even march on the iron throne as we do have a claim on that
It is a weak claim, so we need to get a move on on that. However, thank you very much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video.